Well, hello there and welcome back. So we're going on to Atlanta. We got like four races left. So Dale Jr. is still your points leader, but Gordon closed the gap after Martinsville. Jr. finished last, I think, and Gordon finished second. But uh, yeah, it's definitely looking to be either, oh yeah, Gordon or Jr. Maybe Dale Jarrett if he gets shit going, but uh, definitely one of those three. Uh, we'll take a look at the rest of it here. We're going to scroll down. 37. Gah! Damn, remember when we were like 32nd in points? Good times. Well, I mean, we even ran and we finished 30th. So that's not too bad, but I think we beat Jack Sprague, but yeah. Oh, that sucks. So, uh, we'll pretty much, uh, yeah, we'll select our stuff here. We got two races left on a chassis repair. Uh, we did that after Martinsville, so. Unfortunately, there's really, I guess we'll take this chassis. Uh, 61 engine power, so we got three races left on our Daytona build, two races left on an engine repair, and then I guess we'll be using that engine basically for the rest of the season. Uh, and then our body, we're going to be taking our best body. Uh, this one still has two down for us. And then as soon as we get enough money, we're going to get uh, body number four repairing. That's going to be our Daytona body. That's the one with 64 down for us and 57 drafting, I think. So uh, hopefully we'll have enough money after this race. If not, we got to get got to get it going next race. All right, that's qualify. Once again, we got to qualify top 30. Pressure is on. This is a track that, honestly, you never really know where we could qualify, but we got to qualify top 30. So we got to earn money to get that, you know, the, the body for Daytona. So um, this is a track where I feel like we can do it, so we got to capitalize here. But, uh, yeah, I feel like the setup's all right. I probably could have loosened it up for qualifying, to be honest with you, but... I don't know. I mean, 61 inch of power, I think, something like that. We got a decent amount of downforce in it for us. So, 43rd, first time by. Oh, I think I might have got back into it too early. No, it's all right. Started turning there right at the last second. Oh, it's gonna be tough, man. I hope we got enough in it, but I'm afraid we don't. And a three and four. It's hard to get it to stick all the way down to the white line. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Get every little bit out of it. Oh, boy. Woo! Boy, I was not, uh, I was not confident about that lap time. We're okay, boys. We're okay. We're live from the Atlanta Motor Speedway in Hampton, Georgia for today's running of the Georgia 500. This place has it all. They even have a nine-story office and condominium complex right here at the track. And there is always great racing to go along with the amenities. Isn't that right? The high speeds that can be reached here does make for some exciting racing. There are no restrictor plates to keep them from being able to pass either. It's just all out good old stock car racing with the best drivers in the business. I can't wait to get this one underway. The O2 car really needs a good finish in this race. He's got a long way to go on the points list. Yeah, those guys have been working so hard this year. It's a shame it really doesn't show in the points. Just seems they can't keep that car out of trouble on race day. And maybe their luck will change today. The 83 car hasn't performed well at all at the Speedway tracks this season. Man, that's the truth. That <laughs> makes it even harder to focus on race day. He needs a good finish today to regain some confidence in himself. Kyle Petty looks to turn his luck around in this race. And trust me, it hasn't been for a lack of effort. Those guys have been working hard all season. Maybe they can ride the ship with a good finish here. Kill the car. Don't kill the car. We need the Dale components Earnhardt for next Jr. week. The NASCAR Dale Earnhardt Jr. Is starting from the pole. Oh man. So where's Gordon starting? Starting in Oh, he's starting deep. The oh, he's starting. Rusty oh no, is that him right there? The yeah, it is. I didn't. I didn't even. <laughs> I didn't recognize the faint scheme. All right. Yeah, we got a we got a pretty nice little battle for the championship the here. Dale Jr. on pole and Gordon starting P4. So here we go. Oh man. Uh, of course, we start right next to Ken Schrader. What's up, Jeff? Hey, we're still uh, we're still friends. Plus 78, hell yeah. Oh, cool. okay still Why you always gotta ask me that? Like 200 feet after the race starts. All, clear, buddy. All right. Well, hey, 
I think we actually picked up. Oh, the, 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 yeah, we have. Mm, okay. Okay, this is gonna be a long race. 81 damn laps. And it already got loose. Yes, it didn't get loose in practice, didn't get loose in qualifying. Now half of the race is loose. Oh no. What's up, Ken? Sorry for riding you so damn high. I just couldn't get it to turn. There we go. Got back by Casey. And I know big time Michael. Oh man, it just didn't turn. Oh, nice job, Mikey! <laughs> hey, dipshit! There's a wall there. Oh man, Michael run Michael Walter running out of talent yet again. Man, you know we're still running pretty good, but yeah, fortunately there's just like no way we finish top 30. These tires are gonna melt after a while. It's gonna suck. We're running top 30 for now, so you know, could be worse. Could be just running 43rd like we used to. Like we used to be. I just wish it wasn't so damn tight. I just know as soon as I go to loosen it up, it's just gonna suck. There we go. P29, everybody's starting to pull away from me, and I start getting running over. Start, I start to get run over. And I start to make mistakes. And I start tearing up the damn car. Oh, and it starts to shove. Oh, I hate, I hate it with a passion. I really hate it with a passion. I will tell you that. Fucking the thing's getting loose at it too. Oh, and it's starting to do that. Oh man, who wants to be a caution? Fuck, I hate this man. Oh, it's, it kills me. Eight laps, man, eight laps, and it just goes to dog shit every fucking week. There's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing I can do about it. At least the good thing is we kind of stalled out here. I'm following Steve Park, mending our relationship here, and sharing him a little bit of draft. But yeah, I mean, we, we've kind of stalled out here. So at the end of the day, I'd settle for 34th. I'm just afraid that we're not even halfway on fuel yet, and the car is going to hit that next stage of bad. And then we're going to continue to go back from there. There you go, right front, warned. Here we go. Now Casey Mears and Greg Biffle decided, oh, we're going to get up on it now. Here we come, boys. And we still got a little bit of a ways to the next group of cars, but they'll be here. They'll be here. Here we go. Here's Casey Mears. Oh, man. So now 22 laps into it. Lost contact with Casey Mears, but... Ryan 35th, and we don't really have anybody behind us, but they're coming. They'll be here. Now I lost draft with Casey Mears. Now they're going to get up on it. They're going to start tracking me down. Yeah, Jack Sprague. Oh, yeah. Kevin Grubb. Oh, yeah. That's what they do. They just start pouncing. Hey, here comes the leader, Dale Jr. How you doing? So he's going to put me a lap down. Pretty easily. Hey, go ahead, Dale. It was fun riding on the lead lap. We're almost there to our pit stop. I'm gonna take it as long as we possibly can here. I don't know what the fuel window is, so. Oh, here, here we go, there it is. And hit the wall, all run. Just didn't turn that time around, yeah. Had to, had to get in one of those corners where I just lose a second. Fucking damn it, I hate this with passion. Damn, I was gonna slide up and it's Tony Stewart. I'm just gonna say there. fuck it. I'm gonna pit next time. Okay, we're clear. You gain a position. Oh, somebody hey, Jeff Green out of the race, cool. Far inside. Stay calm. You Underneath fucking idiot. Harden, Harden out of the way, Please don't hit me. Hey, you fucking hit me, you fucking idiot. Jesus Christ, big problems here in Atlanta. Thanks everybody! Thank you! Stan Barrett, you fucked up. You fucking idiot. I was meant. I was. Oh my god. I was meant. I was. Mm. I was just chilling. Minding my own business. And here comes Big Dick Stan fucking Barrett. Oh my god. Now I'm dragging. Now the car is fucking broke. 
And there goes my race. Because the thing is just going to be shit the whole rest of the way. I'm lucky I'm still here. Fucking idiot. Jesus Christ. <sighs> I guess nobody probably crashed out of that too, huh? Am I right? Well, I'm pitting. And so is everybody else now too. If you're going to do that, at least do it like before I go lap down or something. Before you go lap down. Oh my god, who looks alright coming out of the corner anyways? Fucking... The car's just killed. The car's fucking killed. The body's gonna be done, not gonna have any downforce next week. I don't even know where we're going next week. Not like it matters anyways now. Plus, uh, hope we don't see Stan Barrett again. Alright, yeah. Well, it looks like they fixed it. Not, uh, it could, could be worse. So, I came out in front of some guys, so that's cool. Alright, hey, here's Jeff Gordon. I'm P40, okay. Oh, Stan Barrett's out of the race. Is he really? Yeah, I bet he is. So I guess 40th is the farthest we can go back. Or are we in front of David Green? Is he gonna pass us? What the fuck is your problem? You want some? I'll take all my ink. I hate, I hate this fucking game. Oh my god. He's a little angry with your driving style. Be careful, buddy. Yeah, I, I'm the only one who can blow tires in this game. Everybody runs over the same piece of metal. I come, my stupid ass comes in, blows the right front, kills it again. Thanks, Ashton. Why is debris always falling off Ashton Lewis's fucking car? It's always Ashton fucking Lewis! Who has something fall off of his car? Whatever sponsor bonus I get this week, I'm spending it all on duct tape and I'm sending it to Ashton Lewis's stupid ass crew. Yes, I'm gonna give me some pits. Put me four fresh tires on and I'm gonna track down David Green's stupid ass and turn him around. I don't know why. Why we gotta bounce off of me down the straightaway? What the fuck did I do? Are you pet are you mad because you piloted in the crash and Stan Barrett caused? Is that why you're mad? Are you mad because of Martinsville? I don't remember hitting you in Martinsville. I don't know why you're mad, I don't care why you're mad, but stop hitting me in the middle of the fucking straightaway when we're racing for 40th. Fuck! Oh my god, well, that's a penalty. Outside of the, outside of the pit box. Top notch cam right here. Oh my god, I wouldn't have been upset if blew that right front and just blew the engine. Why couldn't we have done that? 41st. At least the worst we can finish is 41st, I guess. Oh my god. Alright. Well, here we go. Let's try it again. I don't know if I'll be able to catch Jeff. Uh, David Green, I know who you are. But, uh, yeah, maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, it seems like we're down 100 horsepower at the moment, so we'll, uh. We'll give it a minute. Oh, that doesn't look promising. Sorry, Ricky. I thought we were crashing there. Everybody was kind of piling up there. <laughs> I just wanted to get to the bottom. The 15 car is inside. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't fucking hit that. Great. Four more freshies, everybody. Is that off David Green? I bet it was. At least we're still plus 80 friends with Jeff Burton. That's pretty cool. Oh my god. Lord help me. Lord give me the strength. Lord give me the patience. Yep, David Green's dumbass. Oh man. Hashtag four more freshies. Oh man. I don't know why it's just so hard for us to get up to speed. I mean our car is pretty much like a mangled soup can at this point. But... Oh man. <laughs> it's rough. Oh, Sterling, what's up, Sterling? Oh, Jamie, what's up, Jamie? Okay, I realize everybody wants to get by, but if we could just all just chill out just for a second, you guys will get by when you get by. We still got like 40 laps. So we're we're right here at halfway, so just just chill out for a minute. Oh, we about done did it. We about done did it right there. Wow, that 
broke up the field a good bit. Well, that's good. <laughs> oh, look, look who it is, David Green. Got a bone to pick with you, David. Yeah, block it up, champ. That's okay. I'm gonna get next to you one way or another. What's up, buddy? What's up? What's up? You want to hit me down the middle of the straightaway, huh? Oh, figures. Oh, there's one blown up. Nice. Another spot for me. Thank you, Mark Martin. Yeah, David Green's got a little bit more speed than I do. Go figure. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get up here too. It's a pretty nice corner right there. Good. Oh, go figure. Why wouldn't it? Why would it turn him? Turn him? Turn him? Turn him around? Fucking damn it, man! Fuck. Oh. oh boy, we got cars on pit road. This must be the pit window. Oh boy. Shit, I'm in P29. Based off everybody pitting. Well, it looks cool for now. Get my needle threaded. I'm the meat in the sandwich. Oh, and I'm fucking loose. And I'm about to be killed by Robbie Gordon just being there. All right, well, that's the end of the, the, end of the string of cars. That's great. Thank God. Thank God. I didn't want to fucking run this race anyways. I barely scraped the wall. Engine falls out. Fuck off with it. Fine. I didn't want. I didn't want engine power next week. Fuck it. Here we go. We're back up to eighty-nine thousand. Great. Shout out to the sponsors. Really appreciate it. Race stats. Mike Skinner wins. Congratulations. You're welcome. Ah oh, man. Of course, yeah. Mark Martin managed to beat me. He got it. To, got it. He blew up, but he got it back out there rolling again. Just, just to pick up that spot on me. Fucking shithole of a car. Well, all I know is somebody's gonna get shit on in Phoenix. Please let me repair my body for Daytona. Please let me have enough money. <laughs> Something's getting sold. This body price sucks, right? Yeah, kinda. Fuck it, I don't need it. I'm repairing this damn, this body. One way or another. There. Two races. And our, uh, hell yeah, our Daytona body is ready. And just about good for our, yeah, for our Daytona engine. Uh, we're, we're still trying to figure out what the hell we're going to do for a, for a chassis. Uh, I guess we're going to have to figure that out, too. Alrighty, well, there you have it. Going on to Phoenix next race. Um, once again, you guys know what happened the last time we went to Phoenix, so that'll be fun. But uh, at least the good thing is we got our, our main engine and our main body out of the uh, out of the way and done and ready for Daytona. So, yeah, not the result we wanted, but we did what we needed to do. We probably could have finished a little better, but honestly, our car was killed after Stanton Barrett. So, um, yeah, I'm not too bad about David Green, I guess. But all I know is I need to find Stanton Barrett at some point throughout this Phoenix race.